Hello, happy Friday everybody. I um, am really enjoying coming on and doing these little oil um, oil blurbs, I guess. So um, hopefully you're enjoying learning and watching them. So today, um, it's Friday, so we're at the end of a very long week. The kids have been home and we've been trying to keep busy and stay in some kind of a routine for everybody's uh, sake. So I've been using a lot of this, uh, this uh, blend that I'm gonna talk to you about today. Um, it's actually one of my uh, favorite oils. Um, I love it for a lot of different reasons. It's just very, well, it's balance. So it's doTERRA's grounding blend. Um, so I use this one all the time. I really love applying this one to the bottoms of my feet. Um, so it absorbs really well um, when you're applying essential oils to the bottoms of the feet because the bottoms of the feet have very large pores so it's getting into your body very safely um, and just really promotes overall sort of grounding, calming, relaxation. Um, it helps to reduce, sorry we have some background noise over there. <laughs> Um, it helps to reduce feelings of stress and anxiety and just tension. Adrena. Thank you. Um, so yeah, I've been using this. I love diffusing it too. It diffuses really nicely with wild orange, which I talked about um, yesterday. So that it's a really great combination together. Um, another way I love to use it is just even just smelling it right from the bottle. It's really, really nice that way. Or taking a little bit, I'll just run my fingers along the top of the opening there. Um, just rub them together and just literally massage it into the temples. And it's just, it's just super, super nice. And down the back of the neck, it's very, very supportive for um, just really providing a nice grounding feeling. Um, so as I said, this oil, it's not a single oil, it's a blend of oils. So it is a blend of spruce, um, whole wood, frankincense, uh, blue tansy and blue chamomile. So it's, um, just a wonderful blend. It's very, um, it's earthy, but a little bit sweet at the same time. So, um, really, really supportive. Um, so again, I will read you the, how it works with our emotions. So the grounding blend is known as the oil of grounding. So a very clever name. Um, it's primarily a combination of tree oils and roots. So trees live in the present moment. They're not in a hurry, they are stable. The grounding blend's soft energy is excellent for calming hyperactive children. Hence the reason I have really enjoyed using it this week. Um, so for calming hyperactive children who have difficulty settling down. Um, it's also wonderful, a wonderful remedy for adults who need to reconnect with their roots. Grounding Blends strengthens a connection with the lower body and with the earth. Um, the connections are especially important when the upper faculties have been overused during excessive thinking, speaking, or spiritual activity. So again, this I think is why I really love using it on the soles of my feet. Um, just because it just really has, it brings about a, a real sense of grounding and just makes you really sort of slow down, calm down, and just be present in the moment. So I really like it for that reason. I like to apply it to the bottoms of my feet before bed and even first thing in the morning. Um, so it's especially suited for personalities who seek to escape from life through disconnection or disassociation. These individuals may avoid long-term commitments in work or relationships, preferring instead to drift with the wind. Um, this blend reminds individuals that to realize their true dreams and desires, they must stay focused on a goal until it's actualized in the physical world. Grounding Blend teaches true perseverance by assisting the individual in staying present with a specific plan or idea until it's embodied. Providing inner strength and fortitude, uh, Grounding Blend teaches individuals to ground their energy and to manifest their vision with the patience of a tree. So I really love that. Um, I think it's just a really nice message and a really um, great sort of emotional characteristic that it has. Um, so the, the negative emotions that it helps to support are feelings of being ungrounded, um, unwilling to take responsibi responsibility for self or for life, um, just feeling disconnected, feeling unstable, and feeling scattered. So I felt a little off of my normal routine this week. I felt a little scattered because everything has just been um, 
you know, we're not, we're not running on a consistent schedule, which is how we work best. So it's been really supportive that way. Um, the positive properties that it's helped support, um, is just having body connection, stability, perseverance, um, self-contained, grounded, and inner strength. So absolutely a beautiful oil, a beautiful blend, I should say. Um, so yeah, definitely if you don't have this one, it's definitely one to consider. It's really, really great. Another thing I love to do with this one is make my own roller bottle. So what I'll do is I purchase these roller bottles. I get them empty from just a Canadian supplier um, out of Toronto, actually. They just come empty. Um, and then you fill it with a fractionated coconut oil. So doTERRA has a liquid fractionated coconut oil that you can fill up and you add the essential oil to this. So it just um, makes for super easy application. Then you can take this with you or it might be, you might find that you like to apply it um, with a roller ball rather than straight from the bottle. Um, so it just really extends the life of of this bottle here by, by diluting it this way. So you're still getting the same um, really great, powerful benefits of it. You're just actually spreading out the application. So the coconut oil or any carrier oil actually helps to keep it um, on the surface of the skin longer. So it's not just absorbing and evaporating off of the skin. So it helps, so you're gonna get the benefits of the oil much longer when you do dilute it. Um, so yeah, that's my, one of my favorite oils of the day and I've used a lot this week and yeah, so if anybody has any questions or you want to know any more, just shoot me a message and, um, I can definitely hook you up. Um, so I hope everyone has a great day, the rest of the day and a wonderful weekend. I think most of us are kind of getting back into a scheduled routine next week. So kudos to everybody that's made it through. So have a great day and we'll talk soon.